Well, you've probably been hearing a lot about the record heat in places like Alaska. Europe had two record heat waves with triple digit temperatures in Paris, almost unheard of. But now that heat is translating into a part of the Arctic that uh, rarely sees this kind of heat, but we've been seeing the Arctic warming at more than twice the rate as the rest of the planet in our warming planet. That heat that Europe had last week translating deep into the Arctic over Greenland, helping to accelerate already rapid ice melt loss uh, of sea ice and also of the glaciers uh, inland on top of Greenland. Look at some of the temperatures today. We're looking at highs near 70 in parts of coastal Greenland. That's pretty warm, uh, 20 degrees plus above normal for many places uh, from Svalbard into Greenland and through that North Atlantic area. Now those warm temperatures are melting the uh, ice, both sea and glaciers even quicker than normal. These are a, a view of some of those glacial melt ponds or lakes on top of the Greenland ice sheet from satellite. So they are bigger and uh, more so than normal. And 2019 for the Arctic sea ice has been running very low right from the beginning of the year. We have seen sea ice less than most years. And right now at our current trajectory, we potentially are in the running for the lowest minimum. By the time we hit the end of the summer, the Arctic summer in September, that's when we see the least amount of sea ice. We could surpass 2012 as the new minimum.